Christy, it is September 23rd. We're taking a little stroll, but um, our minds are on a trip we've got coming up. Where are we going? We are going to the utility show in Louisville, Kentucky. We are so excited. Yes, formerly IQ. We were there two years ago, and that was the last time anybody was able to go to um, IQ. And um, you're always wearing a backpack. People are always impressed with your energy. You're a trade show veteran. Uh, what do you like to bring with you to a show that keeps you on the top of your game as you're meeting new people, re reigniting friendships, and seeing old friends again? Oh, I always try to keep my backpack full of nutritious snacks. RX bars are great. Um, since I'm in Vermont, I've discovered Vermont Smoking Cure. Beef sticks, turkey sticks, pepperoni sticks, I love those. Um, mixed nuts are also a great snack that I keep. And then towards the end of the day, when we've been walking and talking all day, energy's waning, I always keep my endangered species chocolate. Nice, nice. Uh, you've been to a couple of shows uh, since, since the early stages of 2020. Con Expo was you know, when everything uh, really started to get impacted, but you've been to a few since then. Uh, what's travel been like if, for somebody who's never, who hasn't been on a plane just yet? Yeah, if you haven't been on a plane, travel's not bad. Um, masks are required from the minute you step into the airport door all the way on the plane um, until you walk out of the airport um, at your final destination. It's really not bad though to eat or drink. You take your mask down. Um, but Low clearance. Everybody has been really cordial and nice and travel's good. Feel safe We're, the whole time? I feel safe the whole time. But if you want a rental car, Better luck next year. <laughs> yeah, odds are a few days before the show, they're, they're, they're long gone. Yes. Um, so we're gonna get there on Monday. What are we gonna be doing while we're there? We are going to be meeting new people, seeing all the new products and machinery coming out. And most excitingly, we have our teammate, Kristen, who we're bringing and she can meet everybody. I think you're gonna love her. I'm going to be there with a the camera uh, filming the sights and sounds of all things Utility Expo. So uh, I'd love to share your story. I'd love to show off your piece of machinery. What's the latest and greatest? So uh, if you see me, don't run away. <laughs> I, I don't want a hard interview. I just want to hear about you. Um, the weather two years ago was so hot. Uh, so hot. Um, yes. mid, mid to upper 90s despite the sunshine was a little bit oppressive. Yes. As the meteorologist in the room, I of course went ahead and looked ahead. Sunny, 70s to near 80 each day. Travel on either side of the show doesn't appear to be a problem right now. No big weather systems impacting um, any of the major hubs, maybe some storms uh, in central and west Texas on Monday. But overall, I don't see weather playing a huge role in preventing you from getting to the show. So we hope to see you there.